What's up, y'all? Today is gonna be another episode of Life, Art, and Sickle Cell. I'm gonna share a little bit about sicklecellart.com. Since 1999, around 1999-98, when Cafe Press launched, I started putting my art on clothing products and posters, cards, and you know, buttons mugs things people could buy online so I started putting it on creole.com then I I started here on sicklecellart.com so I have a few shops over the years it's just like cafe press and and other places it's like my coffee press shop it's like when you click you go to one of my my websites that have products this internet so this thing has been up for a long long time it's a store I had for many years I made changes so it's just you know for sickle cell awareness for people to have a place that they can buy stuff you know it's like each work that you use each thing that you use you know like if somebody buys this thing for twenty four dollars I might get like a dollar for or royalties so cafe press has been on online since nineteen ninety nine so you see how long it's been up here but let's see I could get like maybe two or three sales per year so maybe in a year I get thirty dollars <laughs> or something you know so it's not really that much it's just up for for the sake of of passing the day passing the time because sometimes you know I tend to put all these artworks on products just to pass the time and just to get just to stay creative when I'm not able to paint so this is my zazzle.com one of them anyway you can buy prints you can buy stamps these are actual postal service stamps you can use them on at US Postal Service uh, mailing so there's a whole lot of little products little things little trinkets so that's what that's where my stores are at it's like you can get this printed on canvas really large for five hundred dollars you can get like a forty by sixty really large printed on canvas so I've never really sold one of them but I think I've only sold it once to someone but um I've just launched a new store uh, this follow past week. I've been working on it. This is um Rage On. It's like all over all over print. I had them on Cafe Press and Cafe Press doesn't do all over prints anymore. They only do for toddlers. So now to find a place that does it for adults, I went to Rage On. So that's my store at Rage On. And I've been working on that since for the past week. I do not have um, the files perfect yet. I do not know which. You know, I do not know. Most of the files I had for my Zazzle.com and my um, Cafe Press, all my old files. They are gone basically once you upload them because it wasn't my old computer that had all those files. So I can't reproduce everything I had. But it's like starting over and redoing works. But what I like about this is that uh, you can get some. I haven't. 
it's not like cafe press cafe press would allow you to do the front and the back separate images this one only does one image for the front and the back so it's just a, a, a copy the front and the back will be the same I wish it was different but still if it comes out looking just like this it's worth the 75 79 or 80 dollars I would pay for this basically I wanna order this because if it comes out looking like this as sharp as it is looking I would love to have this so that's something I would want to have so I share it on my my Facebook when I create the products and I, I just share them on my Twitter so far I've had one sale and it's cool you know it's cool to have the sales when you when you want you know so from one sale my my making I think I get like five bucks for one sale five five seventy nine or five seventy five for my royalty I'm waiting for a coupon code that can save people ten dollars but I haven't got the code yet for people to use so that's what I've been working on and I'm just you know trying to figure out my life right now depression is kicking my butt most of the time and it's like I'm just trying to maintain man I'm trying to trying to figure it out my internet access is like really really slow and my computer is really really slow <laughs> it's dying on me so there's a lot of frustrations like when you're trying to do something and you just can't because as you can see it's just you know that's like why I get depressed sometimes when I'm being creative online and it's like you know you get things that just frustrate you because it's like ugh you know it's like nothing works everything is slow and you just feel frustrated and you just like even after you finish doing these things nothing sells and you wonder what's the point you know it gets frustrating you try you know to do something so the reason I started over was because um I had all these Creole.com got hacked last year and I had to move it to some other service for a while and I move it back but I'm not making no money off AdSense anymore so that's like a hundred dollars per month that's gone so it gets frustrating and it's like you know you still you still want to be creative you still want to you know make sure every day you know you try to learn something new because you want your life to be worth it you want all the pain that you suffer through to be worth it you know this thing got four likes I don't know why it's so popular <laughs> but it's um hashtag poo for peace <laughs> this is how depressed I was yesterday it's like I was I basically made a product that talks about taking a poo <laughs> I try to you know I try to um, use humor in order to keep 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 going because it's like you get so frustrated and you get so disgusted at life and it's just like so I just had this idea just wanted to just create something way way out of hand <laughs> so instead of designing a proper proper product I just decide design this so now you can buy it on uh, it's a nice brown I would say but the 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 thing I wrote on here is you know strange so it's hashtag poo for peace 
This is a bandana, and I'm going to read it. It says, you ever get into a foul mood, and you go take a shit, and you feel much better? The whole world is constipated. The whole world is seriously constipated. The right to poo is a human right issue. I believe taking a good shit could end all wars. Shit for world peace. Poo for peace. Hashtag poo for peace. That's all it says on this thing. But it seems like everybody's into it. <laughs> because it's getting more, more likes than the other ones. So yeah, man. It's like... If I had the money, I'd definitely wear a Poo for Peace shirt. I, I definitely would buy this. So when you you buy this, because it has the zipper, it cuts off the image. But the back is the mirror image. So the back is going to you know, be totally visible without this zipper cutting it so it's basically the back that has the best image but I would like to see how these print out brown is like one of my favorite colors anyway so I use some oranges and browns and everything so I didn't want to make it disgusting to be like poo but it's just a stupid design that I just wanted to do and it worked out you know I'm, I think I would order one after I order a sickle cell one. I would order this. So I'm going to start a collection of just wearing these. Because once you have sickle cell and the winter comes around, sweatpants, I haven't worn sweats in a while. So I'm going outside, going in the cold. Definitely not going to do that. So I have a lot of things here, you know trying to put together this 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 design right here is something I always wanted to do most people don't know what it is it's like they you know if you see it it looks really nice it's like you know one of, like one of my friends posted on Facebook it's eye candy but basically the man who killed Mart uh, Tra Trayvon Martin sold a a blue painting of our American flag on eBay for over a hundred thousand dollars in an eBay auction you know a painting of a blue flag so one of the things I did was to create a tribute for Trayvon Martin and Black Lives Matter editing the exact image of that blue flag and editing it in a way that it represents Black Lives Matter and um, it's ironic that the person you know who killed Trayvon Martin had a flag that says you know one nation God you know and liberty for and justice for all so you know so I, I, the question is for all and you're like really you know and, and you're getting paid a hundred thousand dollars for a stupid ass flag after you murdered someone you know you get away with murder so that's my my protest piece really I think it came out nice I would probably have to buy one <laughs> so each one of these things man I would buy you know so I'm going to be collecting these things for a while so I'm going to make a, another uh, my nurse uh, this is an art piece I gave to my nurse Randy and it's like you know I told them to take an image for me because I wanted to make products for other folks to have one of those things I'm gonna create one right now just to show you how I create I just press create and I upload my image and I put my product for sale you know so let's start with this you know I don't like the way this thing is too much Kinku.com and Sickle Cell Warrior. Let's just put, um, yeah. I don't want to keep it keep King Tut. I 
I just put the same description on everything because um it doesn't really matter. This website doesn't seem to value descriptions that much. Let's just say design two. And just do the f shirt first. So basically right now I don't have an iPhone or a smartphone to upload my images the way I want. But this website doesn't take um, 300 dpi, it takes 150 dpi. So a lot of things I have to learn about what quality of the product. Uh, you know, I hope hopefully it's a good quality print because I do want to order the hoodies and the sweatpants. When you have sickle cell and you you just like dealing with all that, you know. This is a good sickle cell piece. The reason uh, it's after I did this many years ago, then I re-edited to turn it into a. Uh, when I first did this, it was when before I lost my vision. I did this around the time I was doing Haitian Girl. That was 1997. The same time I was doing the sickle cell work. So this piece has been out since 1997, and I redid it last year. Then I gave it to my nurse because he's a cool dude that's, you know, always been doing my phoresis. He's like, you know, he's a real cool guy, you know. So, as I'm moving this, I can see that the image is not where I want it to be. So I enlarge it a little bit. This would be a cool, really cool shirt, so let's go with that. So I, I say send to store. That's for $40 if you buy this shirt. So I think, you know, I don't know how much I would get. I haven't sold it yet, so I don't know how much my royalty is. But that's my image, that's my art, so I've already done it, and it's up for sale. You know, as soon as I click that, now I can share it on Facebook. So anytime if you're on my Facebook and you see one of those things pop up, they're just not pictures I'm sharing. They're actual products you can buy on my store. <laughs> it's like people are wondering, you know, can you get it made? Of course, it's on my store already. You can buy this thing right now. You know, as soon as I made it, it's for sale now. It t maybe takes two weeks to ship, but here you go. It's for sale, you know, and it you help you know help me with my rent, help me with my food, you know, because I need to make these sales. So that's what's up. That's what's new, you know. I think I have some money coming in from AdSense. I'm going to take the train down to New York and try to p give out some flyers for my Patreon because I really want to two thousand. You know, I really do want like 2,000. I want 2,000 patrons at $1 or something like that. Because that would really change my life. Because I'd be able to pay for my own health care. Pay for my own rent. You know, pay for my own food. And, and, and paint, you know. That's my dream, you know. Because this website, there's many artists out here. On this website that make it you know they 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 get they do their own art and they have a lot of patrons that help them per month so right now I have 14 patrons 14 people who are donating an amount of money right now I get $73 per month so what I'm trying to do is get to a level per month where I can get off disability and, and, and reach up, up my goals so this is an image. I can't wait to wear the hoodie, so you can see how to print print out. That's kind of kind of product I'm building. I'm gonna wear the hoodie, and I'm gonna take a picture of this. 
again so I'm gonna go I'm gonna go head out you know to New York and ask people to become my patrons on patreon and hopefully I can make it because um you know I wait I'm waiting on you know the ability to 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 get out of the the situations that I always feel trapped in because I feel like I'm I'm creating and I'm trying to 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 go above you know to to be above my depression how I'm feeling you know see this person has a a hundred and eighty six patrons and they make eight hundred and ninety three dollars per month so I have to get to those levels man before I can even get off disability because um once you get to those levels then you you you're getting somewhere but I need the 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 amount of people to 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 really do that you know and I, I need the amount of uh, of people to really be able to do that so I'm looking at different people who have different patrons different things so look at this one this one only has 76 patrons but this is how much they get up per month they get two thousand five hundred and twenty eight per month you see but this person what they do is cosplay basically she dresses like a, a whatever you know whatever she sees in anime she cosplays so basically bunny girl you know she she dresses up and and shares the images and that's all she does and that's what people are paying for you know two thousand dollars for skimpy outfits and wearing Wonder Woman she's cosplaying I'm not hating on that stuff but I'm just saying you know if a person can just put little clothes on and 76 people are gonna pay her two thousand five hundred per month to do that kind of thing I'm not asking for too much for me to just create my artwork and get people to help me out you know that's where I feel depressed man and feel hopeless because what is it what's what's wrong am I cursed or is it is it me is it what I what I'm saying or or are people in my community just don't really give a damn you know <laughs> It's like it's it, it it's pathetic <laughs> because I think what I'm creating is worth something, you know. I mean, look at this big piece of art, you know. Fourteen people believe in what I'm doing right now, and I'm 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 really happy that that they're helping me out. But I'm trying to reach like four hundred or or, or two thousand. That's my dream, you know, because I want to be able to create not only one piece like this but maybe 12 to 20 because i want to have a, like a big show somewhere man i want to i want to be able to sell my work i want to be able to do things you know politicians are raising billions of dollars just to lose elections i want to be able to raise millions of dollars just to cure sickle cell because i think it can it is possible we just have to give a damn <laughs> we really do have to just give a damn you know and that's why that's why I want I want to continue to work on my on everything every day it's like if you're asking how I'm doing I'm not doing so well you know because I, I'm fighting my depression I'm fighting my life and I'm I'm trying trying really hard just to keep going but it's not all easy you know it's not it's not it's not as simple as just asking for help because no matter how many followers you have on your Facebook or how many Twitter followers you have, people just ignore the fact that you are asking for help. If I was cute and I wanted to cos cosplay as a bunny in a bunny suit, maybe I'll get to two thousand dollars or something. But just a black dude who's painting—that's <laughs> the thing, man. That's the thing that's frustrating me, man. I just think my, you know, maybe I'm high on my own shit. 
<laughs> but I think I, I I'm talented enough to 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 make it. You know, I want to make it, and I think I'm talented enough, and I just want to do it. I just want to make it. Man, this shit. I don't know why. If you don't think that shit is dope, I don't know what you think. Because I want to wear this shit. <laughs> I want this shit right now. I want to wear that. That I want to rock this right there. This this thing is dope. Yeah, I'm just saying. You know, if you don't think it's dope, that's you, man. But I just think it looks cool. <laughs> King Tut, the Secret Cell Warrior, man. That's my design. And guess what? I press this button right here. Boop. You know. That's it. It's on the store, you know, and you can buy it right now, you know, that's it. It's dope, and you can buy it right now, you know, as soon as I share it, it's up and running. But that's the thing. It's like, do I have to beg people for, for $2 to be my patron, or can I get people to buy these products? It doesn't really matter. Whichever way it happens, I'm just hustling. I'm just hustling, baby. Because I'm trying to freaking change my life because I don't like the way it's been going. I'm getting older and older and I'm still struggling. That's some bullshit. <laughs> That's what I'm about right now, man. I'm about changing this shit. I'm about ending my pain. I'm about getting off... You know, my own bed and, and getting out there. Even if I'm low energy and sickle cell is trying to keep me down. I'm just like, fuck it. Just gonna keep 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 grinding. Keep sharing. It's like, you know, how many days these, it takes me to paint one of these paintings. You know, it takes me days, man. So, to be able to put it out there, I feel good about it, you know. To be able to do whatever you want and, and just share it with the world, I feel good about it. So if, from one photo that my friend took today, because that original piece I gave it to you know my nurse, like I said. But from one photo, and from editing it the right way, I'm able to put them on products and I'm able to share it with more people. I'm not making a print of this at all. Because I don't want to make a print of it. The person I gave it to should own that piece. Because that's where my heart was at. To give. Because you know. What I think about giving away art. It's it's more precious to me to give away art. Than to get somebody to buy my art for, for something. Like 600 or, or 800 or, or 1000 dollars. You know. I've sold work for those prices. But you know. It's more meaningful to me that I give to people who matter to me in my life. You know. What those people do for me, like, you know, my nurses and doctors. And, and, and these people save my life. They, they help change the quality of my day, you know. It's like, I haven't seen this pain in a long, long time. All I'm fighting right now is my depression. You know, and 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 the frustration of, of trying to get off disability and, and food stamps, stuff like that. But there are things I don't have to deal with because I've had people in my life who really fought for me. You know, so when I give artwork to my to my doctor or nurse, it's because you know. When I go to the hospital to a clinic for 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 hospital for a doctor visit or or treatment, you know my insurance paid for that. You know Medicare Medicaid pays for that. Nothing come out of my pocket. But if I give a piece of work, that's my work. That's my 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 blood and 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 my creativity. My own hands created that. You know that's my worth. That's my money. That's that's my value. So when I give that to someone, it, it means a lot to me because it is from me. It's not from from the government. It's not it's not it's not monetary. It's it's something I created. I learned that from 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 the way I used to give show my mother love. I didn't talk to her much, but I always made her cards. I made her flowers out of my own hands, drawings and art. You know, she got all these things. So I like giving, and that's what this art piece means to me. You know. 
it's like I'm creating these products because I just want to sp spread awareness about sickle cell disease but the original piece was inspired by people around me in my life that that helped me you know make it through through my days so yeah it's like yeah I get frustrated I curse and, and I moan and, and I bitch you know but I'm trying to stay above it I'm trying to stay positive but you know I have to start seeing some successes happening it's like people say keep the faith but they don't understand that a, a, a man will lose faith easily when they see that everybody around them only just prays for him but they don't do nothing you know if you believe in God God doesn't work without you taking action or in doing something so I'm I'm doing all the good good actions that I can I give back I, I, I spread awareness I I, I I I maintain you know but I don't I don't show everybody my good works it's just I'm just hustling to make sure that people that come before behind me never have to deal with the pain that I've dealt with you know so I'm spreading the awareness the, the way I can. It's like I, if I have this gift, I need to share it. And that's it, you know. That's how it works. You know, as soon as I share this stuff, it's live on, 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 the, on the website. You can buy, purchase that thing right now. It's just live on the website. And, you know, I pick which products I'm putting it on. Do I want to make a, 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 a whatever, you know. It doesn't matter what what product I'm putting it on. It's just I just make the products, and um, if you buy it, I get you know royalty from from the company using my images because the company is printing without my image. They would just print the white the white pants, but with my image, they get a piece of art that they can sell to other people. This. All websites that I have on, they ship internationally. So no matter where you live in the world, as long as you can pay for it, they can ship it to you. So you know, there's no, there's nothing that's stopping anybody from buying these. As long as I put them up, you know, I put them up there. You can buy it. They're a little bit expensive, but even I'm going to buy one. You know, as soon as I come back from New York next month, I'm going to start ordering them. Because I'm going to start my own little collection. And I hope to start seeing pictures on Facebook of people wearing my stuff. That would be cool, you know. There's a lot of, I'm going to be working on in the future, in the near future. Right? Because I just want to keep going, keep, keep grinding, and, and, and keep positive. But, you know... There's a lot of things that take me off my game sometimes, you know. Sometimes I worry about my next meal or sometimes I, you know, I worry about my health or I worry about depression. But that's that's just part of the whole thing with my life. You know, as soon as I click that's it. That's the tour. That's how I I create my products. That's how I work. You know, that's what I wanted to share. So, it's been Hertz Nazair. Life, art, and sickle cell. Just spreading awareness about my life and what I do in my daily. When I'm not sleeping at 4, eight, four o'clock in the afternoon. I'm creating products to try to maintain my life or to try to, to put, be hopeful. That people will give a damn and um, support, you know. So as soon as I share this stuff, man, it's gone. It's gone. Let me stop here. So, peace and a whole lot of hair grease. If you want to see this stuff. Check the description. I'll have a link to the store. Peace.